During the sixth week of the disbarment trial of John Eastman, former attorney and constitutional legal scholar for Donald Trump, two witnesses from Eastman's team provided testimony. Attorney Kurt Olson, who is currently representing Carrie Lake in her election challenge, was the first to testify. Before we get started, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification button to be notified when we post great videos. Let us know your possible suggestions by leaving your comments below. Following him, Ray Bleher, a retired Department of Defense analyst, presented his findings regarding the vote laundering of approximately 280,000 to 300,000 votes in Pennsylvania through electronic tabulating machines. Olson commenced his testimony by providing an account of his involvement in an election lawsuit pertaining to the 2020 election. He expressed his initial concerns, stating, I harbored a belief that something was amiss. He proceeded to outline the specific issues that troubled him, including video evidence depicting poll workers being denied the opportunity to observe the tabulation process, the contentious situation in Michigan's Antrim County, inexplicable results such as the abrupt cessation of ballot counting in pivotal counties overnight, and blatant violations of legal statutes. Earlier in the trial, former Wisconsin Supreme Court Justice Michael Gableman testified that the voting machines in Antrim County had erroneously switched the vote from Trump to Joe Biden, although this occurrence was dismissed as an error. Gableman further asserted that due to the deletion of log files, it remained inconclusive whether this discrepancy was intentional. That's what we have for you today. What do you think of our video? Let us know in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe, like and hit that share button.